budgeters welcome back to not broke just budgeting i'm so glad that you're able to join me once again today's cash stuffing will be my third paycheck in december i will be i do have an extra paycheck for this month so i will um or to have a leftover, I will be stuffing in my cash envelopes. And I just want to say thank you to my subscribers for continue following me. Thanks for my new subscribers. Um, if you want to become a subscriber, like and comment and hit that subscribe button. And I hope everyone had a, a blessed week and that you are hitting your financial and budgeting goals. Now let's count today's cash stuffing. Now I really don't want to count this, but we'll just do it in increments. So we have $200 and it will be a larger um, than normal cash stuffing. Because again, I do have an extra paycheck. So I do have some extra to um, concentrate and give that um, those extra monies to my savings so we have 200 one two three four five hundred how's everyone's christmas shopping going i know i had a less stressful um christmas uh shopping experience because again my kids are older so i just gave them cash so i hope that if you know if you do um buy christmas gifts or believe in, in christmas that you were able to get um your family kids their presents without being stressful or going into you know significant amount of debt Let's count 20s. 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 85, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 87, 20, 40, 60, 88, 20, 40, 60, 89, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,000. So we have 1,000. In 20s, we have one 10 by itself, they're right there, and we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, and fives, and we have um. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-six dollars, twenty-seven dollars, twenty-eight dollars, twenty-nine dollars, twenty-ten dollars, twenty-eleven dollars, twenty-twelve dollars, twenty-thirteen dollars, twenty-fourteen dollars, twenty-fifteen dollars, twenty-sixteen dollars, twenty-seventeen dollars, twenty-eighteen dollars, twenty-nineteen dollars, twenty-twenty dollars, twenty-twenty-one dollars, twenty-two dollars, twenty-three dollars, twenty-four dollars, twenty-five dollars, twenty-six dollars, twenty-seven dollars, twenty-eight dollars, twenty-nine dollars, twenty-ten dollars, twenty-eleven dollars, twenty-twelve dollars, twenty-thirteen dollars, twenty-fourteen dollars, twenty-fifteen dollars, twenty-sixteen dollars, twenty-seventeen dollars, twenty-eighteen dollars, twenty-nineteen dollars, twenty-twenty 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 doll
I've already spent it, but I'll take it out of this. So I always allocate 40. So we had $60 and my husband also contributed to this. So we were able to get us, you know, a nice steak dinner or whatever the kids wanted. Not nothing, you know, extravagant, but it was, it was pretty good. Um, gas, still allocate 40 for gas. Groceries still the two fifty. That's where I wish I could decrease my expense. But again, I try to cook as much as I can if I'm not tired. And when I do cook, try to cook you know healthy stuff. So that's that. So that's it for my um, envelopes. Remember, I was not going, I'm not going to do all of my sinking funds, but I will be doing um, my daughter's and I will be adding $20 to hers. And that should leave her at, and I didn't do this prior. $1,802. So I'm not going to count that. I'm just going to add 20. Let's see what she got. 15, 16, 17, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1,800. Come on, I'm trying to now build this up quickly as possible. And one month ahead, let me tell you about the story of one month ahead. Oh, my gosh. If I could scream. That's why I want to be so transparent with you guys that even the best, you know, the 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 the, the, the best budgeters all fail sometimes. I forgot. I knew that my subscription of my P.O. box was coming up, but I they don't never give me... A due date and I was thinking that it was gonna be the end of this month well they took it out uh, this week so what I keep in my bank I just have my money for my bills and um, it's my fault I should also have enough for um, just a buffer I usually have you know about $40 buffer but I'm gonna have to increase that but I still had um, some money left over, a buffer, but I had to go in here, my one month ahead, just to replace that because I didn't want to mess up anything else. So I'm going to pay it back. I have it to pay it back. Um, and I think I only have to pay back $75 because I do a six-month subscription. So that just messed me up. But... I was able not to use a credit card and I it didn't mess up my account, any insufficient funds. And I was able to go into my one month ahead because I've been saving it. So budgeting is just a, you know, a really wonderful thing to, you know, stuff like that to happen. But I've learned my lesson and I will. And I took note that every six months, just prepare for it to come out the first of the month. So I won't have this again. But anyway, I'm going to put back $60. I'm going to add, I was add $60 anyway, but I will um, add back $75. So that's the story that I just, you know, just want to be transparent that, you know, I'm human, things happen. But with this cash envelope method, It'll save you to have a cushion, you know, where otherwise, if you didn't have you, you'd have to do credit card. Um, my whole account could have bounced with insufficient funds, and we know the price of insufficient funds. I don't know how much those are now. Are they 25 or $30? I guess if you don't have um, protection. And, you know, I just want, you know, to let you know, hey, I messed up too, but this description I will not... <laughs> going for it. So let's see how much we have. Now we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 
10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60. So 260. And then I again I owe $70, $75 back into this account because in the next maybe four or five months, I want I want to have all this um one month ahead, and then I want to start doing two months ahead by the end of the year. That's my goal. So we have that. So we have one month ahead, Chloe. Now let's go into our challenges. And let me pull out the box. And I stopped at number 74. And I'm going to try. Well, I'm going to today. I'm going to do 75 through... 88. I told you my goal is to have ah, right on the bunny. I have one more video to show you this. So let's do we're gonna be doing number 75 through 88. And after that, I will color in uh, once we finish. So Seventy-five dollars is fifty, seventy-five, and I'm just so excited when I get to unstuff this at the end of the month. Seventy-five, seventy-six, fifty, seventy-five, six, and I'm going to be just aggressively, continuously doing this challenge every time. I finish one, just keep aggressively doing it. 50, 70, 5, 6, 7. That is my goal. And I will be having a video. I will be doing a video showing how much I have saved in my journey since, let's see, in five months. What I've uh, uh, saved in five, my five-month journey with doing the cash envelope. So that'll be interesting. So 50, 70, 5, 6, 7, 8. Because it has been a journey, but it has been a pleasant one. I've had some hiccups on the way, but I can say that it's been the best thing um, that I've done for my financial life, my personal life. So 79, 75, 6, 7, 8, 9. And just learning and, you know, coming out of my shell, wanting to, you know, talk about budgeting items. And next year, I want to dive more into your credit score. Just trying to build, you know, everyone up. Um, 50, 20, and the importance of credit, how to maintain your credit. There's so much I thought just be racing in my head. All my goals for next year. Let's see. 81, 20, 40, 60, 81. We got a lot of these to do. Let's see, 82, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 2. And put in the comments below what savings challenges will you be doing for 2023? 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 2, 3. Or what would you like for me to do on the channel any educational items let's so remember we're in this together we're trying to build up our financial personal life so that we can enjoy life 84 it's nothing like a peace of mind. Don't never let nobody tell you. Oh, peace of mind is everything. 
40, 60, 80, 5. And it's just, you got to take action, you know. It's one thing to write down your goals, but you got to have action. It's going to get hard. No one's saying it won't be hard, but you got to be determined. 20, 40, 60, 80, 5, 6. Did you know how many times I wanted to give up? But I couldn't. I just kept the course. Let's see. 87, 50, 60. I mean, 70, 70, 80, 5, 6, 7. But we can do it. Let's see, 20, 40, 60, 20, 40, 60, 80, 5, 6, 7, 8, 88. Yay! We're almost there. Will we make it? I've seen so many of these videos. It's just so inspirational. So it was 75 through 88. So now we got 89 through 100. And let me go ahead while I have this up so we can see our progress. It's one thing to see it on there, but let's see our progress with the sheet. So we did 75 through 88. Yay, we did one, two, three, Five, six, seven. You don't have to be perfect colored in, you get the point. Maybe two. 10, 11, 12, 12 more. And I think next, the next one that I do, I won't keep it so uniform. I'm going to just pick and choose so it won't get so hard at the beginning. Just mix my amounts and I'll probably still do another one of these with my box and just kind of do it like that. That'll make it easier and not so much ooh, stress at the end. So that's that. Now, let's do our penny challenge, our last challenge for today, because we've done our 100, done our 200, and let's see, we're up to $70, and we stopped at $2.38, and let's see... Oh, we come up with 2.38. Let's see. Two point fifty five, two point fifty six, two point fifty seven, two point fifty eight, two point fifty nine, two point fifty 
That's 44, 62 yeah seventy dollars two sixty to say two or three and that's seventy dollars and twenty two cents and I think I can come up with some twenty two cents so I'm gonna get my little Dog, we're gonna add our seventy dollars. Yay! I can't wait to count this. So let's do. We're doing seventy dollars. Started at 238 and went all the way to 263. Okay. And we're almost there. We have this what three three and a half rows left. And that was an easy challenge. I really enjoyed that. And what you can do once you um finish. I'll take some alcohol, paper towel, wipe it off, and I'm going to start this. This is going to concentrate on this also for 2023. Once I complete one, just keep completing it. Just keep, just redo. Just keep doing it. Well, that is it for this video. I hope that I wasn't rumbling off too much. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this video, and I will see you on the next video. Bye.